finally here, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the Big Brother Season 7 finale. I am joined with LEGO Master 627, and we are going to finally end off Season 7 as it should have well, months ago. But life got in the way, but now that won't be a problem anymore because we are going to end off this finale for good. So if I can top LEGO's intro, which I probably can't. But, um, so, goodness, um, so without further ado, let's begin the Season 7 finale with throwbacks as far as you can go. And indeed, she is actually correct. So many throwbacks. Trust me, you'll actually see the point when we get it. Right now! <laughs> okay, seriously, let's just stop messing around and get right. I wish so everyone, as you just learned earlier, we, um, we are starting off with the final four, HOH. First off, since I'm not in this finale, since I'm, I'm not a part of the game anymore, as you can see, you do not see me on this list. So, I'm only here as hell. Yep. Since she got me out of the game a month ago, or was it one of the sheep? I think it was um. one of the sheep that got me out a month ago. Anyway, we're going to do this. I'm only going to tell you yes, and also, do you see that ice out there? <laughs> that is the Beetle Knot. Because I don't, let's just be honest. I know, I could probably stop. No, 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 that's not a bad thing, I'm just saying, like... Um, alright, so the Big Brother Season 7 finale is finally here. In the Season 7 finale, you must get through two HOHs, one final needle, and the last two evictions. After all, that only two will remain, and one will win this entire season. So without further ado, let's do the final four HOH. Alright, so what we're going to do first is, as you can see, the lab trivia stuff is still here, but for only three more days. So, because I cannot think of anything better to do for a Final Four Age of Age, I thought, let's just do the lab trivia all over again. Also, I don't think both of will manage to actually get all of them, or did she? What do you mean? I think you were able to answer all of them, but... Yeah, but now I'm going to see if I can answer them, so... Okay, now you want to start off with the ones outside. Now, first off, you have to bring the sheep. Okay, so let's go do that. Alright, so what you have to do... Alright, I'm, I'm going to jump to when we start the HOH. Oh, very... Yeah, same here for Lego. If you guys had to watch us, like, drag up the sheep here, then it'll... Yeah, yeah. yeah that's uh, why I thought... be a little irritating for you guys. Do you just want to get around with the competition or anything? So, we cut out that part for you. That's why I thought... Actually, I think we can only pick up one at a time, and because if I back up two at the same time, then we get stuck between. Yeah. Alrighty. So we're gonna do is we are gonna bring them over to the last room. Alright, over here, we are going to stick them to. Oh, I don't want the store working. I want to. Right here, so they can stuck to. Okay. No. Not oh, whatever. Shoot, yeah. I accidentally undid it. Uh. Okay, so you, along with that, Purple Sun Gaming, Flower Sheep, and Center Print Production all have to answer these trivia questions. Well, there's two of them out here, and then the other four are in the lab office for each of them. So, yes, we are going to have to do this. Alright, so without any further ado, the questions have already been laid out for us. Well, yeah, these were laid out like two to three weeks now. Well, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Honestly, I knew you were. Yeah, it's been a crazy uh, schedule. But um, anyway, without any further ado, let's begin. Which Halloween party was the Haunted Mine introduced? And it's funny because it's only just right there. And our, qu our answer to I kind of stopped lying around. A. Halloween Party 2015. B. Halloween Party 2016. And C. Halloween Party 2017. Well, I can already mark off Halloween Party 2016. 17 because that was just recent. So I'm gonna go with answer A. Purple sign. Correct. Oh, I was gonna like put all the sheep's answers in too. Well, that well yours was correct. All right then. <laughs> yeah, sorry, forgot that we also have to do that too. All right. All right. When, when, all right. All right. When did the UFO come to the lab for the first time? So we got answer A, April 17th, 
2016, no, I just didn't see the 8, B, November 19th, 2015, and C, February 18th, 2016. Do you remember which? November, I'm going to put in my answer, B, Purple Slam Gaming, C, Cinderprint A, and Flower Sheep, B. And the correct answer is B. So now Purple Slam Gaming, right? Did I say that? Flower sheep. Oh, right, Flower Sheep. Okay, my memory is not good. Actually, no, Flower Sheep has one, right? Oh, right, because they didn't So, so me and Flower Sheep both have a point. So, so where, so it's... Wait, what, how do I have two, then? Well, because you answered the first one. Oh, that's right. Again, my memory is not my best friend. Um, anyway, let's go into the third, the lab for the third. Um, and actually, where the rest question. of them are. Yep. So let's do that. Who is the first sheep in Zoe's lab after um, Mr. Sheep? A. Goodness gracious, I cannot see that. I probably really highlight those. You might want to. Um, A. Sheepy. B. Goldie. And C. Lapa Sheep. Okay. So. The, I'm going to put an answer A. Center print. Like Alright, so I put an answer A. Cinder is answer A as well. Flower Sheep is C. And Purple Sun Gaming B. The answer to the question is A. It was Sheep. If you remember back five years ago. Alright. So I think now that we have. I have three points now. Yep. Wait, who else answered A? Uh, I I seriously cannot remember. Why do I blank out like this? Well, I need to keep a tally. That's what, that's what I need to do. What? Well, hey, I have a list next to you with all the stuff we're doing. Uh, I don't know who I said, and if I say it wrong, and I have to rewind it, and then it's yeah. goodness gracious. Um, I don't know if you said maybe Clara David. Anyway, Alright, let's just give let's give flower sheets up. If I remember, I'll I'll put that point back. So what was the first event in Zoe's lab? What was the first event? Okay, I was waiting to see that. Um A beginning of Zoe's lab party. B Valentine's party and C St. Patrick's party. Oh. I'm thinking the Valentine's party. So B Flower Sheep. A, Purple Sun Gaming, B, and Cinderprint, B. Wait, wait, did Flower Sheep say A? Hey? Yeah. He's the only one who got it correct. Oh, uh, what? Remember, the last start is in January, which is why the anniversary party is going by right now. Um. So, Flower Sheep is the one who only got a point. So I think she has three now, along yep. with me. Okay, so... Two more! Alright. When was the theme park introduced? A. May 2015, B. June 2015, and C. July 2015. Do you remember when it was introduced? I'm calling B. Purple Slime, Purple Slime Gaming, C. Cinderprint, A. And Flower Sheep, A. the only one who got it correct. June 2015. Alright, so now, alright. You have like... Four points. Four. Yeah. When was Evil... When, when... Okay, yeah, I read that right. When was Evil Sheep Leader discovered? A. November 5th, 2015. B. November 12th, 2015. And November 19th, 2015. I'm putting in my answer as A, Flower Sheep B, Cinderprint C, Purple Sun Gaming C. You are the only one who got it correct. You have five points, meaning you win. And that means I'm the new current HOH of the, I'm the final HOH. Correct? Nope, you still got the final three. Right, right this is final four, I'm sorry. Again, I apologize for my really bad memory. It's... Not doing me any good right now. Oh, we haven't done this uh, series for almost four weeks. 
You can't blame me there, I guess. Yeah, we can't blame her. We did a lot of stuff. She was even on a fast recently, so that's another reason we should not do this as early as you think. Yeah, I decided to cut away from all technology from that time. You can see a recent so video that I made for that. Anyways, so, you want there? Uh, it's now time for the nomination ceremony. And the last nomination ceremony, like, before the final frame. Because next time, you actually, they're both automatic. All right, so without further ado, let's select those nominees. This is the last time you can choose it. All right. You get a whole lot better at. All right, so my all right, so let let's not waste any time and say like this is the final nomination ceremony for the season. So I'm going to select my two nominees and they will be considered the final nominees on the memory wall for this season. Well, before final. Yeah. Uh, all, right. all right, my, my first nominee is Power Sheet, and my second nominee is Cinder French. Oh yeah. Please forgive me, Cinder. Um. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure she won't care. So I'm sure it's not pretty sure she won't care at all. So let let's start this off with. The veto with no time to waste. This is the last veto of the entire season. Again, to the ice May. So according Actually, to according to the, like the list that I'm looking down at, Lego apparently has this entire list planned out. So it says the final veto has the ice maze. But this time, actually, you guys remember an ice maze we did at the beginning of the season? Yeah. I, th I think you would only remember that. You have the memory. This is actually a recreation. Of and Alright, so I'm going to be taking Cinder from Productions through the maze. If you want to take up any sheep, go and for I'll it. I'll be taking Farsh and, uh, Alright, so it's that any further ado, let's begin this final veto. Alright, three, two, one, go! Let's begin this final veto. If I, if I can get him through. It's, not gonna, it's gonna be hard pulling myself and a sheep throughout this time. Well, I'm trying to get them all through here, and don't. Oh wait, duh, I could just fly and make this like a lot easier on myself. Oh yeah. I'm not. I'm not cheating. I wouldn't do that. Not intentionally. Last one. Last what is? I don't know. You built it, so you would know, right? Dang it, I could not make it over there with Cinder. It would have to like... Yep, just... Actually, I think I stepped on the... on the... uh... pressure plate first, but I didn't bring... So in this case, Purple Slam Gaming, you are the last veto holder. Yeah, because you did step on before me. If you watch Lego's footage, it'll show you. You know, since they're both recording different footage. Yeah, so I gotta, I gotta grab them. Hold on. All right. We eviction. So we'll meet you back there. All right. Let's begin the final veto meeting.
Purple Slam Gaming, as you had won the power of veto, you can either sentence sentence these two nominees to eviction by keeping the, nom the nominations the same, or you can save one of them by removing them from the block. All up to you. Alright, she has chosen to remove one of the nominees. And that is... Cinder Print Productions. And since I'm the only one... Wait, am I the HOH? So... Yeah. In that case, well, what do we do? Can they... They can't nominate the HOH, can they? Well, shoot. You can't do it! Can't exactly think that one through, can I? No, nope, you have to keep them. Dang it, so we can't take anyone off. I did nope, not... You can't. I did not... I did not think that through. I'm so sorry. No, nope, yep, they have to stay. Alright. No okay. If I was still in the game, they could have just not been in the game. Alright, so... I guess that was a bit of a turnaround vote. So, the nominations have remained the same because of an error we made. Oh, and, guys, are you ready for a little throwback? Well, dude, little we can't let them drop down. Oh, that's right. Well, I, I, hmm. yeah, I gotta plan this out a bit more. Hold on, I gotta go through. Nope, not again! Back I go. Okay, seriously, I need, I need to stop doing that. Go to survival, go through. Okie dokie. Yeah, you can see what our difficulties were now, trying to get the contestants through here. And that was not fun, because they kept going through and disappearing, we had to keep coming and getting them back, and that's just... We'll give them the portal later. Anyway, time for the first eviction of the whole thing. Alright, so as in the HOH, I'm only, the only time I'm allowed to vote is at the sole vote of eviction. So, and, uh... The only ones voting really right now is, well, Purple Slam Gaming and myself, correct? Yep. Purple Slam Gaming votes for... Flower Sheep. And I too, since I do not have the heart to vote out my best friend, my sole vote is for Flower Sheep. Alright, Flower Sheep. In that case, me, Cineprint Productions. What do you mean? Right. Wait, who did they choose? Flower Sheep. Okay, yeah, then Flower Sheep could have gone out of here anyway. Alright, so, well. <laughs> yeah, there we go. So I'll take them to the jury house, and I will meet you when we're in front of the jury house. Yep. Wait, did you ever notice any difference? Uh-uh, no, you stay in there. Stop it. No, everyone's escaping. Uh, not in the plans. Come on. Alright, no! we go, everyone's back. Okay. So, uh, let's put that door over there. No one gets out. But okay. first, before we do get to the final three HOH, here's where Flower Sheep is in the jury house now. Hooray! Woo! Alright, now, 
Is the potion lab maze. And that is on the rim. Let's head up there. And I only put the skates here just in case we have got to escape. Yeah. Go to the pass through. Alright, now since this is the final free HOH, everyone can compete. Am I saying that right? Yep. This is the final one. Oh wait, I don't think it'll work. Getting them up here? No, I don't believe so. Yeah, that's what I just said. It won't work. And I'll be right back once we get started. They run into a lot of problems, aren't we? Alright, we have to respawn. So apparently Lego figured out something that I didn't even that didn't even cross my mind. It is the first season with a YouTuber finale. That's my right, guys. Everyone, the final three. I only just realized this just now, and then I just told Rose of this. All three contestants in this finale for the final three are all YouTubers. Wait. So that means myself, Rose Crystal, Cinderprint Productions, an animator, an, an animator, my beloved best friend, and Purple Slime Gaming, who is also who is also a friend of mine. So without that, any further ado, we see that we have a YouTuber finale, the first season with with that kind of thing. So let's get our two famous YouTubers up here if we can find their spawn. <laughs> And then watch this. Yeah. Shoot, let me go do that. Oh, seriously, why did the sad music have to kick in? We're doing a celebration here. Come on. Oh, come on. No. No. Oh, she's going to fall down the ladder. <laughs> All right. Everyone, I present to you another throwback. Remember the post If there is a torch in here. Halloween party 2019. October 2019. So that is another See, I love the throwbacks in here. I, I legit forgot it was 2020. I think is it what do you mean it's a throwback? Uh, like, I, I swear again. I legit forgot it was 2020 uh, for a second. Well this room was from back then. Okay, so what do you want us to do for this final HOH? Well, this is part one. Yep. Okay, so the starting line is right here. Yep. And what you have to do is, you have to go all along the maze, pretty much all around this path right here, all the way to the finish line right here. Okay. Now, obviously, you don't need to cheat for this. No, yeah. They grab these guys. So, so they have to all escape from them. Uh... Two, we'll grab Cinder Craig. And I will grab Little Slime Game. Here we go. Although the only difference in this room is that uh this path right here never existed. Because remember this used to all these stairs. Mm -hmm. If you remember back from this room. No! Come on! <laughs> Alright, finally we got him. <laughs> What the heck is going on here? Alright. Where is this? We're never gonna get this finale finished. Finally! Come on! Alright, I don't know where Herbal Slum Gaming is, but I'm just gonna carry it sit up right no matter what. Goodness, how many floors did I fall? Good to I have. Hold on, I'm just gonna come here. Okay, we got it. I am really sorry for the many pauses, but I don't even know. 
All right, let's begin. All right, so now we got it. All right, so Lego explained we have to go through this maze, and... I carry Cinder Fret, and you carry for the fun game. So the start is right here. So, are we all ready? Oh, wait, wait, wait. We're start at the same time, so we do not go all at the same time. All right, ready? Three, Three two, one, begin! <laughs> and before you ask, this is actually the same maze from back then, so it doesn't change. No, that's cheating! <laughs> they, 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 keep, they keep jumping over the stuff, so it's... Well, that's kind of the bad part about having the potion lab stuff. Because it makes them cheat! Who win? I won. I got here, but Ribbison Gaming kept jumping over stuff. Oh, well. Our next one... Actually, it'd be a lot better than this one. So, Purple Slime Gaming. Wait, wait, wait. Who won it, actually? So, Purple Slime Gaming. Wait, wait, wait. Well, because you and Purple Slime Gaming are in this. So, who was the first one to touch the pressure plate? I was then. Yeah, for... then that means you win part one. You go directly to part three. So, that means this is going to be a competition next between Purple Slime Gaming and Center for Protections. So, yeah. For the spot for the final two. And this, my friends, is the second part of the final HOH. You know, a underwater so battle game. between Center for Productions and Purple Slime Gaming. Well, I'm Production must go through all these water tunnels, and the first one to reach the finish line right here goes on to the third part of the Rose Crystal. So! Y'all clear? Yep. Alright, we got both of them. Yep. Alright, yeah, we had to respawn them because, yeah, they couldn't even get out of this room. So, here we go. We that seems to be a recurring theme this episode, just respawning it. Well, yeah, and also, you won't have to respawn them next time because the last one is also out here. Alright, so without further ado, take up Purple Slime Gaming because I have Cinder. So, yeah. first we're about to have a lovely, lovely underwater adventure. All right. Without any further ado, three, two, one, let's go. Here we go. Jeez, what did this turn into? Goodness gracious, what? Oh no, oh no, crap, ah, ah. Oh! Whoa! The heck did all this turn into? Alright, who got over there first? Uh, well actually, no one's even crossed the finish line yet! You have to reach the cobblestone! Ah! Uh, can't get out of this dang water! Oh, did you see it? I don't see it from back here. Oh. Who touched it first? Uh, it would say, uh, I think Cinderprint touched it first. Yep. They're still technically in the water here, but I guess as far as I can take them without taking them outside of the fence. Well, yeah, because they only have to reach the finish line. So, Cinderprint goes on to the last round. And yet that tunnel turned into going over the tunnels because they flew too high up and that got yeah. them up here too. No, we didn't know that we didn't feel like it, it's just that we didn't know how long sheep were gonna last on the water. Now before I take it down. Wait, what? Sorry, I didn't... The underwater adventure. Yeah, like, was it named for it? What, what do you mean? Like, did it live up to his name? Definitely. Because you can go underwater. Perfect. 
Alright everyone, moving on to our last round, and first up, I gotta first off, uh, drain all the water to get all those pillars out of here, so I play our last HOA. I mean, Mark Spring. Yep. And, he will be right back to do that. In a few minutes, or actually one second, because it costs one second. Alright, welcome to Season 7 Trivia, the final part of the final HOH. Alright, well, like I said, um, I'm gonna be Earth reading. Crystal versus Cinderprint Production. Who will win? Alright. Hey, uh, Lego, like, how about you take these questions since we'll be reading off the questions? Oh, yeah. Wait, wait, I did not get that second one. Alright. Wait, wait, what does the second one mean? What, admin? Or is it evicted already? Wait, wait, wait. Wait, what does that mean? Or... It means, like, creator, in this case. Oh. <laughs> wait, are you referring to me? I guess when the, I guess we'll find out, won't we? Okay. All right. Then now I have the question. All right. Question number one. <laughs> when was the massive waterfall, a uh, well, massive water slide introduced? I believe it was episode ten. Uh, what's Cinder's choice? Uh, the same answer, episode 10. Incorrect! It was, I believe, episode 7, I believe. It was May 31st, 2019. Hold on, let me see. Was it episode 7? I want to say. Give me one second. Hold on, I want to see like, what episode number was it, because I can't remember. Uh... That, well, that was you, like a master. Oh, yeah. It was me since I was out of the game. And it's still for the rest of the season until season 8. Who knows when that's going to be? Definitely this year. Yeah, definitely. Alright. So, yeah, Cinder also answered that, like a master. I've got to. Answer is flower sheep. So in that case, the tiebreaker question will be... Uh... Alright, so what- so the question was, sorry, I, uh, hit the pause button too early. Which two YouTubers made a special appearance in Season 6 as house guests? Jacksepticeye and Cub Scouts. You are correct. But what is Cinder said? Dude, we can't have another tiebreaker. Cub Scouts? 
and PewDiePie. Good. No more tiebreakers. That means you are the last game to win the entire season. In fact, I think we are actually at our first game to win this entire season. All right, so now that I am the final HOH, the nominees should be obvious since it's Cinefront Productions and Purple Slime Gaming. All right, so I'll meet you guys down in the eviction room. All right, we are here for the final eviction. So any further ado, I only have to choose the sole vote for who will... Be with me in the final two. As HOH, I have that bird now. So, my sole vote, the final sheep going home tonight, is... Cineprint Productions, I'm sorry. But you're coming with me to the finale! Purple Slime Gaming, you're out! Sorry. Dude, that is so perfect. That is so perfect. Here we go. The finale yes. between two childhood friends and YouTubers. Let it begin. Yes, let the finale officially for the last two begin. Are we ready? Oh, and right. I may as well do the honors of cleaning up the trivia. Alright, so I, I'm going to grab all the jury members and bring them here. I'm going to clean up the uh, thing in the process. I'm going to clean this up. Alright. No, seriously, this is the part that needs to come on right now. Yep, and alright, this is the end of, the se of Season 7. So, let's end it with one final vote. Who will be the house guest to win this season? Me? Or Cineprint Productions. Let's find out. Hey, uh, do you mind keeping a tally? Yes, like always, every year. Yep, can you do so? Yeah, we're doing it again. You know. Yeah, see so ya. So how about this? You give me the paper, okay? Actually. If you have a pencil over there, you can keep keep record. Okay, so, uh, here we go, here we go. So I'm just gonna do it on the same piece of paper as we did on this. Alright, you ready? Quick, okay, okay, so we're gonna put rose. And then we're gonna fill it. And then. And I'm just gonna like what's in it, right? Because it's fun enough. Alright, let's go! Alright, the final vote starts here. DJ Sheep votes for Cinder Print Productions. Okay, that's one. Blossomonite votes for, my, for me. That's also one. Flower Sheep, Cinder Print Productions. That's two for Cinder Print. Purple Slime Gaming, me. That's two for both. Tie so far. Aquaramine, myself. That's three for you. Sheepy, for Cinder Print. Okay, another tie. So who's gonna vote for it? Wait, wait, did you go for all of them? Yeah. What about Aquaramine? I did, and I did Flower Sheep too. I made sure to get everybody. Uh, uh it's a tie. So who will be the deciding soul vote? Wait. I'm one of them! Uh, yeah. I'm one of them! Oh, that's right. I'm one of them! I'm one of the jury members! Then it's your choice. This is... This is true. Wait a second, I just realized. You both have won a season before. You won the first season. And I think Cinderprint won the fifth season. So who will be? 
Yeah. Oh, this is gonna be so hard. Which one do we choose for the second time? Well, here we go. Are we ready? Yeah. The final vote goes to Rose Crystal. Yeah, me tato. So with that, Season 7 has drawn to a close. I hope you guys will join us for Season 8, and without any other further words, thank you for joining us on this season, despite how long it took when it came to like making episodes and everything, but I'm very glad you guys stuck with us throughout this entire season. And with that, it is now drawn to a close. Again, I hope you guys will see us for Season 8, and with that... I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys. Okay, I just pause mine because I want to actually end up.